was a high school football star following his dream in college. Good evening, I'm Mike Dardis. And I'm Cherie Palello. Tonight we found out the 19-year-old killed in a motorcycle crash was a freshman running back at UC. Allison Montoya spoke with his former coach at Lakota East tonight about the person who was much more than just a player. Allison? Good evening. Sh Shereen and Mike, good evening to you. Shamada Kennedy Palmore played some of his best football right here at Lakota East High School, but his former head coach tells us tonight that he's better known for the person he was off the field. Lakota East head football coach Rick Haynes says the world lost one of the best. What a tragic loss it is you know, for his family and for his teammates, but he was going to make someone a great employee. He was going to make someone a great husband. And a great father. And those are the things, you know, that you think about. His former star running back, 19 year old Shimada Kennedy Palmore, died after his motorcycle was hit by another vehicle. Those are the two things that just stand out about him is how hard he worked and how he treated everybody. Shimada, a red shirt freshman on the UC football team, was riding his motorcycle on Vine Street near the zoo when police say the driver of a car turned left into a parking lot right in front of him. He died at the hospital and the tragic news spread quickly to friends. He was just a great guy. Like every time you saw him, he would smile. Like like no matter what he was saying, he had this little he had this little grin on his face and just just a great guy, like all around. Friend and former classmate James Myron said they shared the same love for motorcycles and even texted last night about a new bike. That would be the last time the two talked. My buddy said something really good today that, like, just say I love you to the people that you care about and let everybody know that they mean something to you. And of course, tonight, Shimada's family said in a statement that they wanted to thank the entire community, of course, for the outpouring of their support during this terrible time for the family. As for the driver, she remains at the hospital. No charges have been filed. Reporting live, Allison Montoya, WLWT News 5. Allison, thank you. The UC football family is also in mourning tonight. Head coach Tommy Tupperville spoke about Shimada's love for football while on his radio show with 700 WLW tonight. And he also talked talked about how close this team is. It is truly a family when it comes to these players. They're around each other, they eat, they sleep together, they do all these things together. They go through a lot of tough times. And this kid was had a smile on his face every day. He came to practice. He loved football. Shimada's death comes just over a year after the death of red shirt freshman offensive lineman Ben Flick. The Hamilton High School grad was killed on September 21st last year in a car crash on his way back from a victory over Miami in Oxford. In last year's crash, two other players were hurt.